obviously, you know, people have been talking about Tank possibly fighting Ryu Venezuela. If that fight was to happen, what do you think about that fight? Man, man. I'll give it, you know. I talked to Ryu. He said he'd go to 135, too. Oh, yeah. So, I'll give it six rounds. Round. The most. No, this six rounds at, the most? Yeah. Looking at, you know, looking at him. What it, uh, I'm watching him, you know what I mean? I, I've been watching him too, yeah. Six I rounds the most. Six rounds, six rounds the most. Yeah, no disrespect. It's just my opinion. What do you, what do you, what do you see in him? And like, he's a southpaw, he's a boxer, but he's a puncher as well. He does leave his chin up in the air a little bit, but like, why, why do you, do you think that he's like easier than a Martin, a Frank Martin? Yeah, because he take more chances than Martin. Uh, and and what Mar Martin's probably a little bit more tighter with his guard. He more look a little bit more defensive, you know. And, and Rayo, he he come at you a little bit more easy to. You don't have to hunt him down. You don't have to find him. You know what I mean? You don't have to find him. Yeah. Okay. Um. Now, what about what when you see you know what I liked about your other posts? You put like a list of like the top. 135 pounders and you listed them yeah can, can you talk can we can we talk a little bit about that because uh i forgot how i listed them but yeah you just call it and i'll be right uh coach you know you got your other full <laughs> stop player i know you got the list no Come on. Call it. I, i'll figure it out i i know i know something some of the name, I definitely know the names on the list. I don't know how you had them ranked, but you could probably uh, make us. You could have us uh, remember, or if anybody that's on the the live right now, you guys could go check it out, check out the list, and then uh, put it on the comments for us. But obviously, you got Abdullah Mason at number two. Why uh, do you have Abdullah number two, knowing that he hasn't necessarily fought the top guys yet? Wow. Number one, he's 20 years old. And he getting he getting guys out of that. You know, four four or five years his senior. You got guys that's in the top ten that is not getting them out of there. You know what I mean? It, his, 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 his accuracy, his, his, his punch placement, you know? His IQ. And he, he's 20 years old. He didn't get his man strength there. By the time he get 24, 25, like the rest of them, the more they wait, the more of a problem he's going to be. Right mm. now, he can do it. I, that's my opinion. Right. I don't see nobody in the lightweight division under him that can beat him. That's my opinion. People get upset. All they got to do is make their own list, and, and, and that's their opinion. But that's my opinion. He's number two. Name a lightweight under him that can beat him. That way. <laughs> It ain't none. Do, do you, what, he, what's he, the he one that destroy, he destroys the Peter right now? He destroy any of them. Peter. Yes, any of them. I've been like peeping. What, what's the word? Uh, scouting prospect uh, like talent for years. I remember when Trinidad first came on the scene. He made his debut against Maurice Block at twenty years old. I said, "Man, this kid gonna be something." And look at him years later. Just like Abdullah Mason. Okay. He got you know? the complete eye test for you. Complete eye he, test. Yes, and he's getting better and better every time out. He don't play with his food. He get a crowd, the, the, the fans, what they come to see. You know? So then, so what, what makes Abdullah Mason more special than all the other uh, – Lightweights like Shakur. I, I haven't seen him getting a slugfest yet. <laughs> yep. Yep. And he, he hasn't been in the slugfest. He's been in there with some decent, decent, you know, opponents. Opponents. He only 20 years, just turning 20. Mm -hmm. That's mm -hmm. why I rank him up there. He, he's doing everything right. <laughs> and I, I gave him a new name, Abdullah the Brick Mason. Yeah, you, you did. You gave him that nickname. I seen that. He throw, seen he, that. he throw them bricks every time out. You know what I'm saying? How? 
how long do you think this KO streak that he has going on going to last? Throughout his career, he's only 20 years old. He's going to get strong and strong. Right. You know how the game goes. Yeah. 